Okay, let me write the time quickly. Okay, let's begin. Can you see the paper? Yeah. Yes. Yes, okay, let me get my pen ready. Today we're going to learn, let's study the words, okay? Um, Let's see, Bin, you can read these words for me. Yes. Grandparent. Can you read? Grandparent. Oh. Grandfather. Grandmother. Aunt. Uncle. Mother. Mom. Father. Dad. Sister. Brother. Teacher. Divorced. Divorced. Okay. And Bai, can you read these words for me? Why? Husband. Dutch, uh, daughter. Daughter. Niece. Um, niece. Niece. Cousin. Grandchildren. <coughs> Love. Uh, Love. In laws? Mary. Married, yes, very good. Okay. I want to ask you some questions. Hon, is a grandfather a boy or a girl? Hon? Boy. A boy, very good. Okay. Bin, is a niece a boy or a girl? Girl. A girl, very good. Hon, is a wife a boy or a girl? Boy. It's a girl. Okay, a wife is a girl, a husband is a boy. Okay, if you have a wife and a husband, they are married. Okay, but then if you if they were married and now they are not married anymore, they are divorced. Okay. Okay, let's carry on. Let's go and see. Oh, what happened? Um, okay, let me just see quickly. Okay, read and write the correct word for each definition. Okay, uh, Hon, can you read these words for me? Yes. Brother. Brother, daughter. Father. Divorced. Divorced, son. Okay, very good. Bye. Can you read number one? A oh, my spelling. A male sibling. A male sibling. Okay. So if it's a male, it means boy. And female is a girl. Okay. So what? And a sibling is a brother or sister. So if it's a male sibling, what is it? Bye. Uh, okay, Hon. A male sibling is brother. Is a brother. Very good. Okay, Bin, let's do number two. Yes, no longer married. He is okay. a dis divorced. Divorced, very good. Divorced. Okay. Hone, you can read number three. A male. A male. A male. Parent. A male parent is daughter. 
Okay, a male is a boy. And a parent is a mother or father. Okay, Bin, you can help him? Yes, a male parent is father. Okay, father. Okay, Bin, you can read number four? Yes, four, a male of child, son. Yes, good. Okay, Ho, number five. Yes, a famous two a female child. Female is a girl. A female child is a daughter. Is a daughter. Very good. Okay. Let's take this away. Okay. Very good. Now we need to complete the sentences. Uh, Bin, you can start number one. Yeah. Middle wisdom has many has many grandchildren. He yeah. has five granddaughters and three grandsons. Very good. Okay, sorry, we didn't see these words. Good. Okay, home number two. My sister has a baby boy yesterday. I have a cousin now. My baby, my sister had a baby boy. <laughs> okay, so. If it's a baby boy, I have a, a few. nephew. Okay. If your sister has a boy, it's your nephew. Okay. Number three, Bin. Who's the man in the picture? That's my, that's my husband. Yes. Okay. Good. Number four, home. Are you or single? I'm married. Okay, Bin, you can help him. Yes, sir. Are, are you married or single? I'm married. Okay, good. Okay, Hon, you do number five. I am an unso. I am an only child. Only child, but I'm not lonely because my uncle family nearby. Nearby. He has a daughter, my aunt. My age. My cousin, my cousin and I and I are my best friend. Okay, very good. Hello, Sam. Hello, teacher. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Okay, very good. Sam, can you put your camera on? Yeah. Okay, there we go. Okay, now I can see everybody. Okay, now we're going to talk about singular nouns. Okay, nouns are names of people, places, or things. Singular means one. So we use a or an for a singular noun. Okay, Sang, can you read these singular nouns for me? Sang? Teacher. Yes. Teacher. School. Pencil. Dog. Okay, very good. We use a for a singular noun that begins with a consonant. Okay, consonant are all these letters. We use an for a singular noun that begins with a vowel. So A-E-I-O-U are vowels. 
Okay, Hon, can you read the singular nouns with a consonant? A cast, the borrow a a cat, a boy. A table, a book. Can you read it for me, Hearn? Okay, Vin, we're going to use sing, we're going to read singular nouns that start with vowels. Yes. An apple, an animal. An I, an elephant. Okay, very good. We can see A, A, E, E. <coughs> okay, here are some words that cannot be counted. That means they are uncountable words. Okay, Sang, can you read the uncountable words for me? Water, kiss. Me, salt, pepper, bread, rice, sugar, money, tea, milk, gas. Okay, very good. Now we're going to practice. Let's see. Is it a or an? Hone, number one. An Ari. Very good. Bin, number two. An, a notebook. A notebook, good. Sang number three. A car. A car, good. Number four, Hon. A bird. A bird. Number five, Bin. Number five, uh, an uncle. An uncle. And number six, San. An arm. An arm. Okay, very good. Okay, now we need to check the pictures of uncountable nouns. Okay, I don't know what picture one is. I don't see that. But let's look over here. Okay, if we can remember, they cannot be counted. Yeah. Okay. Um, okay. Uh, Bin, is number two an uncountable noun? No. No. Okay. Hone, is number three uncountable noun? Yes. Yes. Yes, it is. What is it? What is number three, Hone? A bread. Yes, very good. Sang, is number four an uncountable noun? Yes. A boy? Do you see boy here? A uh, no. No. Okay. Number five, Bin. No. What is this? A meat. Do we say a meat or? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, it is. We just say meat, not a meat. Okay, home number six? Yes. Yes, okay, we don't say a money or monies, we say just money. Okay, now we're going to circle the word that goes best with each picture. Sang number one. Me. B, grandfather, very good. Uh, bin number two. Yes, young, younger sister. Very good. Okay, number three, home. Yep. Married. Okay, they are married. A husband and a wife. They are married. Okay, now let's see. Sang, number four. What does the arrow show? 
Only family. Very good. Okay, bin number five. Sister. Very good. Number six, hon. See my big sister. Very good. Okay, good job. Um, okay, circle the sentence that goes best with each picture. <coughs> Sang number seven. Hey, there are five people in my family. Very good. Number eight, Bin. The boy with his grandmother. Good. Number nine, home. Number eight, an old man is hugging his grandson. Very good. Well done. Okay. Okay. Now we're going to read the hints and circle the best answers. Okay, Sang, can you read this for me? This is a group of people that are related to each other. The, the member can be people such as grandparents, parents, parents, sister, brothers, and cousin. Who are they? C, family. Very good. Okay, Bin, can you read it for me? Yeah, number two. The person is the mother or the mother or father. Is my grandmother. Yes, good. Okay, home number three. This person is the brother of the father or father. My niece. My uncle. Okay, the brother of your mother or father is your uncle. Sang number four. This person is the daughter of the brother or sister. Uh, my my niece. Yes, my niece. Very good. Yes. Okay, now we need to read about Mark's family and then answer the questions. Um, Bin, can you read for us about Mark's family? Yes, my family. Family members. Dad, mom, me, and my little sister. My family description. Dad likes watching TV. Mom is the great cook. My little sister likes dogs. Okay, very good. So we have, this is Mark and dad, mom, little sister. Okay, Hone, can you read question number one? How many family rebels and they are there in Mark's family? Are there in my family. Including him. Including him. You Number A, four. Yes, very good. Okay, Sang, number three, uh, number two. What does Mark not like? Uh, we watch it TV. Good. And Bin, number three. Number three. What does Mark think about his mom? B. Yeah. B, he makes yummy food. Very good. Okay. Now we need to read a letter and then we're going to ask, uh, Answer the questions. Home, do you want to read for me? Yes. Okay. How old are you? Hi, Grandpa. How old are you? I hope you are well. My, my, my paper are doing fine as my sister is also. Doing. Doing well. well. Good. 
I'm very, I'm very excited, exciting because my summer vacation vacation start next Friday. Mom took me that I can visit you during during the summer vacation. Let's go visiting together. It was some so much fun. More fun when we were camping and caught caught some fish last summer. I can went to see you. See you again. Okay. Sincerely, Raymond. Okay, Sang, can you read number four for me? Why is Grandma excited? Uh, okay, let's make it so like you can see also. His summer vacation starts. Very good. Okay, bin number five. Number five. What did Ray, What did Raymond do last summer? Um, he he go fishing. He go fishing. He caught he some fish. fish. Yeah. Caught some fish. Okay. Very good. Okay. Now we're going to do some listening. Let me make it bigger. Yes. Okay, listen and circle the correct answer. Let me just get our listening ready. Yes. Okay. Um, okay. Oh. Okay, sorry, the adverts, we will play after that. There we go. <laughs> TOEFL Primary Step 1, Book 1. Published by EduPlanet. All rights reserved. Unit 1. <laughs> My Family, Part 1. Listen and circle the correct answers. Number one. The girl is watching TV with her dad. Okay, hon. Dapper P. Yay, good. Okay, very good. Sang, this one's for you. Number two, the woman is cooking in the kitchen. Number C. Very good. Okay, Bin. Number three, the boy is doing his homework. C, A. A, good job. Okay. Now we're going to listen and circle the correct answers. Okay? Yes. Home? Let's listen. Part two. Listen and circle the correct answers. Number one. Listen to the girl. Mommy is working late tonight. I am going to order some pizza for me and my brother for dinner. What is the girl going to do? Yay, hey, she's going to order pizza. Do you like pizza, Hun? Do you like yes, pizza? I like. Yes, me too. I like pizza. Okay, Sang, let's listen. Number two. Listen to the man. My grandson's birthday is this Saturday. 
So I'm going to visit him this weekend. Where is the man going to be this weekend? Sang. Next to me. Good. Okay, Bin, this one is for you. Number three. Listen to the boy. I have a baby sister. I usually play with her after school. What does the boy usually do after school? Three, three. Yay, very good. Do you have a sister, Bin? Part three. Oh, oh I have an older sister. Ah, older. okay. Not baby. Okay. Okay, so now we're going to listen and circle the correct conversation. So, hone, okay, they're going to ask the question. You must listen for the best answer to the question. Okay, so which answer is correct? Listen and circle the correct conversation. Number one, A. Do you have any brothers or sisters? No, I don't want them. B. Do you have any brothers or sisters? Yes, I have a big brother. C. Do you have any brothers or sisters? No, you are an only child. Hone, which one is correct? Yes, Letter? B. Yes, B. Very good. Okay, Sang, this one is for you. Number two. A. Do you live with your grandparents? Yes, I can live with them. B. Do you live with your grandparents? No. I don't live with them. C. Do you live with your grandparents? Yes, they live with their grandparents. C. Uh, do you live with your grandparents? Do you live with your grandparents? A. It was B. Bin, did you, did you say B? Yes. B. Yeah, B, okay. Okay, Bin, you're going to listen for this one. Yeah. Number three, A. How many people are there in your family? There are five people in my family. B. Three, A. How many people are there okay. in your family? There are some people in your family. Very C. good. How many people are there in your family? No, they aren't in my family. Okay. Okay, now we're going to listen to the conversation between a boy and a girl. But first I want to read the question. Okay, Hone, can you read this for me? Yeah. What will what will the boy do next? Okay, so if it's next, it means that he's still going to do it. What will he do now? Okay, he hasn't done it already. So let's listen. Part four. Listen and circle the correct answers. Number one. Listen to the conversation between a boy and a girl. My little brother is driving me crazy. How is he driving you crazy? He keeps playing with my toys without asking. Why don't you hide them somewhere? That's a good idea. I will hide them in my closet. What will the boy do next? A throw his toys away. B, hide his toys.
toys. C. Buy new toys. Hon. Double C. Buy new toy. Buy new toys or hide his toy? Vin? B, hide his toys. He's going to hide his toys. I know it's difficult because hide and buy sounds the same. Okay. Okay, Sang, this one is for you. Can you read it for me? What does the boy wish to have? Okay, what does he wish to have? Not what he has now. He wants to have it. Okay. Number two. Listen to the conversation between a girl and a boy. Do you have any brothers or sisters? <laughs> yes, I have a big sister. I wish I had a big brother. Why do you say so? Because I could play soccer if I had a big brother. I wish I had a sister. I'm an only child. I get lonely sometimes. What does the boy wish to have? A. A little sister. B. A big brother. C. A little brother. Me, a big <clears throat> Very good. Well done. Okay. Okay. Now, uh, Bin, this is for you. We're going to listen to the phone message. But can you read the question first? Yeah. Number one. Why did Major Mom call? Okay. A, to tell Major to make breakfast. B. To tell Major not to eat dinner. C, to tell Maya that she will be home late. Okay, so now why is she phoning her? What is the first thing she says? Why? Part five. Listen and answer the questions. Number one. Listen to the phone message. Hi, Maya. It's mom. I will be home mm -hmm. late from work. I'm afraid you'll have to have dinner with your brother alone this evening. There is wow, some spaghetti see. and meatballs in the refrigerator. Heat it in the microwave for two minutes and eat wow. it with your brother. I will wow, try to see. come home soon. Very Call good. me when you get this message. Okay, good job. Why did Maya's mom call? Let's just listen quickly. A, to tell Maya to make breakfast. B. To tell Maya not to eat dinner. C. To tell Maya that she will be home late. Okay. Hone, you're going to do the next one. Can you read the question for me? Who does the boys spend? Spend most of his time with. Okay, his father, his mother, or his grandmother? Okay, who does he spend most of his time? Number two, listen to the boy giving a talk. There are four people in my family, my grandmother, mom, dad, and me. My grandfather passed away last year. So my grandmother has been living with us ever since. Both of my parents work. So I spend most of my time with my grandmother. I love her very much because she makes me yummy cookies and tells me interesting stories. I am so glad that I'm living with her. Who does the boy spend most of his time with? A. His father. B. His mother. C. His grandmother. Hone? Double A. His father?
or his grandmother sang C. His grandmother. Okay, his parents both work. He spends most of his time with his grandmother. Okay, I just want to look at this word over here. Pass away. Does anyone know what that means? If somebody passed away, that means they died. Okay, so his grandfather passed away. He's he died. Okay, now we're going to not play. What's that been? I think the pass away is not play. Not yes, very good. Not living, you died. Okay, good. Now we're going to listen and fill in the blanks. Okay, Hone, you are going to do number one. You're going to tell me what is missing. Yes. Part one. Listen and fill in the blanks. Number one. The girl is watching TV with her dad. Watching TV. Yay, good, watching. Okay, Sang, you're going to do number two. Number two. The woman is cooking in the kitchen. The woman is cooking in the kitchen. Oh, very good, cooking in the kitchen. Okay, Bin, you're going to tell me everything. Yes. Number three. The boy is doing his homework. The boy is doing his homework. Yes, okay, good. His homework, good job, okay. Um, let me just clear. Okay, let's do part two. Hone, you're going to tell me two words. Yes. Part two. Listen and fill in the blanks. Number one. Mommy is working late tonight. I am going to order some pizza for me and my brother for dinner. Dinner and brother. Mommy is working late today or tonight? Tonight. Ten Oops. Tonight. Okay. Pizza for me and my father. Brother. Okay, good. Sang, you're going to do number two. Number two, my grandson's birthday is this Saturday, so I'm going to visit him this weekend. My grandson's birthday is this Saturday, so I visit this on weekend. I'm going to visit him this weekend. This weekend. Okay. Okay, Bin, you're ready. You're going to tell me everything. Yes. 